of the controversial state questions approved by voters is now in effect. State question 780 approved last November. It reduces simple possession of drugs and some property crimes from felonies to misdemeanors, potentially saving taxpayers millions. But some think the new law does more harm than good. Smile back here in the kitchen. Rhonda Bear knows second chances. I have been previously incarcerated. I received a 10 year sentence 15 years ago and it saved my life. She re entered society a new woman and now helps others like her. For Bear, prison reform is a must. Oklahoma is desperate and knows that we have to do something. Bear thought state question 780 was the answer, reducing the number of people in prison, potentially saving taxpayers millions. But now she says the state question missed the mark. Do I think it is important to keep people out of prison that have $100 worth of drugs on them? Yes. Do I agree with I can rob you for $999 and it's going to be a misdemeanor? Bear's answer is no. Under 780, it's now only a misdemeanor to commit a robbery of $1,000 or less, even for repeat offenders. I do not support making more victims and saving criminals. Now, the group Oklahomans for Criminal Justice Reform has told KOCO the new law addresses what they call a broken system and gets to the root of why some continue to go to prison.